And our team is really great. I don't know, we have Zio who's always making jokes, so it, may, it makes it so much easier to play with each other. And it's like, it's not like we have to play, you know, it feels like five friends playing together basically when, when we're playing in the evenings. I've always wanted to get South African esports to a, to a level where, you know, it's not, yes, Energy Esports is my team, but um, it's always good to see esports teams from South Africa try and establish themselves abroad. And, as long as we keep trying to achieve these goals, we're only going to get better with the experience that we gain. Hi, uh, my name is Stefan Smit. Uh, I play as Orange Juice, also known as OJ. Hi, my name is John Apps. Uh, my nickname is Gustin. My name is John Nivot. My nick is Zio. My name is Tian Kurten. In-game Nick is TC. My name is Jan Taran. Uh, oh, sorry, I look at the camera. Fuck. Okay, my name is Jan Taran. I'm ta my, name, my name is Nick is Takbok. My name is Cassie Mahmid. Uh, my nickname is Ian Kawa, and I'm the owner of Energy Esports. What it takes to be a successful team in South Africa, definitely for starters, it takes dedication, practicing with the team, having the right gear, the right setup, and having the right players who are willing to contribute as much as the others to work towards a goal for the team, whether it is being top three or just competing with the top teams out there. To be the best team in South Africa, you, firstly you need a lot of discipline. You need to know that you can't mess around. You, the practice times, especially, you need to practice really hard and you, need, you can't mess around during practice times. Uh, regarding gear, you also you can't play with just a substandard gear you need you need the best and which is also why we're with energy because they have some of the best gear around um, i've played with various uh, different teams um, i think energy is is the best so far i really enjoy it um, it's it's completely different to the other goats the the vibe here the support we get everything we do it's it's completely amazing <laughs> Well, we wanted to go to Copenhagen because uh, they have a, a bring your own computer co competition, right? And you can qualify for the for the top uh, for the top competition. And if you don't, you, there's an, there's also another competition that you can participate in, and yeah, which is which is nice because we want experience. We want experience out of the whole deal. And yeah, if we get to play more games, that's obviously better. And our goal going there is. Obviously we want to do as, as good as we can, but we're also going there with the goal to improve and to bring the international experience back to South Africa. What we're trying to do is a little bit different. We want to better ourselves as players. I think that's the key thing, is if you do go over, you go over to play, yes, boot camp for a little while, but then try and qualify for the tournament properly, knowing that you've actually, you know, you're not in it to win it yet. You have to actually do the hard graft to actually get in there. And hopefully that over the, that week that they're in Copenhagen, they can learn and see where they can progress. The, the value that the sponsors see in that is better than the value that I see uh, are currently really just, just getting a, a, an entry into a tournament abroad. Copenhagen is it's a big thing for us. We've Most of us never been overseas before. Um, we want to play overseas against the pro guys or the top level guys. We want to compete there and maybe cause an upset and obviously just to learn so much more about the game and how they play it and how the guys do it because they, they basically play 24-7 CS and that's what we want to do, that's what we want to achieve. Energy Esports are a pioneer of South Africa, South African Esports. Um, they've sent, this is the second lineup they send overseas so it's, it's really amazing and I'm, I'm thankful to be part of it. It's, it's really, you can't, there's no words that can really express how we feel. Yo, feeling more than excited, I can't tell you. I probably have a few emo emotions in my eyes here and stuff, so I'm not, I'm, I'm, it's, it's hard for me to keep it in. <laughs> we'll try and do our best, and hopefully we'll bring some results and you know, some, uh, some well-needed exposure for our market. You know, that's, that's done now. Let's have a look where else we can go. Maybe Copenhagen's not the last resort. Maybe we end up somewhere else. Maybe Sweden. You know, you never know.